Giggity, 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 giggity. What's up guys, so today we're gonna talk about drum triggers. What are drum triggers you might ask? Well, it's a secret at 200 BPM of course. No, but seriously, it's a sensor that attaches to the head of your drums to replace your traditional sound with whatever sample you want. Kind of like what I did in the beginning of the video. So what's the point? Well, with heavy bands, using triggers and hybrid drumming is becoming more commonly used, and this has raised some eyebrows in the drumming world, same way double bass did originally back in the day. From what I've heard, people want to use kick triggers because once you reach certain speeds or loud enough speakers and amps, the kick pedal gets drowned out and the mix sounds uneven. I noticed with triggered and electric kits, you get a level of consistency almost impossible in an acoustic drum set due to the triggers. And so we can let guitar players have a pedal board with more buttons than the front of a plane but get mad at a kick trigger? It's kind of dumb how double bass is turned into the Olympics of speed instead of who's the most creative with it. Did we forget that this is music? There's a double kick called the duelist pedal. It does two strokes in one kick and helps people reach speeds that they never could. Is that cheating? When you think about it, the only way you can cheat in music is pretending you made music. I like my drums to sound like actual drums and not some perfectly tuned and sampled machine, but that's just sound I'm going for, and I sample from time to time. This is probably only beginning, and we should get used to the hybrid drumming and embrace it. More tools for music has never been a bad thing, and I don't think anyone should see it as such. But what do you guys think? In the world of music, is there such thing as cheating or faking it? And what's your opinion on drum triggers as a whole? My name is Johnny and I make other videos on metal. You can catch them over here and until then, I'll see you later. Peace out.